here we go. So, uh, hi guys, for those that know me, my name is Craig and I got married today. that the Parkins, Waters and Morris families would all be united as one happy family who all grew up together from the same little village up at Clay. Craig, I gotta say mate, it takes a lot for a parent to say yes to a man who asks for his daughter's hand in marriage. And I couldn't have been more sure on that day to have said yes to you. I see how happy you make Maisie. She has a wonderful smile and a beautiful laughter every time you are together. And that's what you would give to her. I am proud to call you my son-in-law. And I, for one, can see how hard you're working to build a wonderful future for you and your wife together. I was really proud to be walking alongside you today. You look absolutely stunning. From that little girl with three dummies, her little, <laughs> her little red wellies, three dummies, one in each hand and one in your mouth, couldn't get two words out of him. And look at you now. You've thrown away your dummies, you've found your voice, and you are a strong, independent, beautiful young woman. And me and your mum are very proud of you. Never change, babe. I give you this ring. As a token of my love. As a token of my love. And as a symbol of our marriage. And as a symbol of our marriage. I promise to love and respect you. I promise to love and respect you. To be honest and faithful. To be honest and faithful. And to cherish you. And to cherish you. Throughout our lives together. Throughout our lives together. Okay, if you'd just like to place the ring on for Johnson. I give you this ring. As a token of my love. As a token of my love. And as a symbol of our marriage. And as a symbol of our marriage. I promise to love and respect you. I promise to love and respect you. To be honest and faithful. To be honest and faithful. And to cherish you. And to cherish you. Throughout our lives together. Throughout our lives together. Okay, you just place it in my Okay. That from this day forward. You are now husband and wife. Many congratulations. You may now see on your Maisie, you look absolutely stunning here today. Craig's a lucky man. 
Then we get to Craig, who's decided on the biggest day of his life is to impersonate the Riddler. But, on a serious note, Craig, I want to thank you personally for giving me this honour today. As being someone's best man is something I generally thought I would never experience in my life. So the, the burning question on everyone's mind is how did I meet Maisie? Um, so we actually worked together for two years in Admiral without crossing each other's paths. And I only knew her name because the jam you get used to win all the early finishes on a Saturday. <laughs> and I remember thinking, God, she's so annoying. Give it a rest and give someone else a chance to go home. <laughs> and then after COVID, we finally met when she sat opposite me and she used to try and play foot smooth on the table. <laughs> and I finally broke the ice by asking if she fancied to do my eyebrows, even though I don't think I've ever had any interest <laughs> in my facial appearance. I think I just wanted some excuse to see what sort of work so I could work my magic. <laughs> and obviously it worked because we're here, so. And the second quote of wisdom today is for a message for Mr. and Mrs. Parker. and comes from a not so wise man by the name of Andy Bernard. He says, I wish there was a way to know you were in the good old days before you actually left them. Well, Craig and Maisie, just remember, these are the good old days. You are about to embark on the most exciting adventure of your lives, starting a family and creating memories. Keep your circle small and your minds at peace. Love each other always, as the best thing to hold on to in life is each other. Maisie, it feels like a love was always meant to be from our families being friends and from the same area and me growing up next door to your aunt, to your uncle and our grandparents being friends. My mother always tells you the story of when you're a baby visiting your uncle and your auntie next door, you're passed over the hedge for my mum to hold you and give you a fuss. But I was playing in the garden on the slide and obviously stealing the attention away from you by shouting, Mummy, look at me on the slide, we. <laughs> so. So in true Craig Park in fashion, I'm going to steal the attention away from you again, uh, Maisie, by saying, every look at me, I got married today, so. <laughs> Finally, I'd, I'd like to thank my lovely wife, Maisie. I think I speak for her when I say how fantastic you're looking. And I guess my bad luck over the years finally makes sense because I for sure cashed all in when I met you. So right now I do feel like the luckiest person in the world, so.